I'm here at the Big Five event in Dubai at the MTech booth, and I have to wear a mask inside, but we're gonna ask them a little bit about how they use this mixer pump for 3D printed concrete technologies. We're also going to touch on a few more of the interesting booths I saw at this Big Five event in Dubai. Of course, you guys probably saw the 20 additive manufacturing booth, but I also visited some of the other booths that were focused around automated construction, including some home management systems around temperature sensors, things like that. I also walked by this booth, which features the formwork 3D printed construction seeks to replace with automated technologies, assembly and disassembly of these structures, including their storage, transport can all be eliminated which lends to the efficiency offered by construction automation technologies i mean just look at all of those bolts that this requires the amount of human effort it takes compared to just 3d printing a structure from an stl file built in some cad software i can't imagine that formwork will still be an efficient solution for creative one-off designs like this most large-scale 3D printed mortar applications like the one you see here actually use step files, which is a point-based program, versus STL files, which are generally programmed to be able to contain water being solid in every direction. Without further ado, let's hear from the Home and Commercial Building Management System. Hi, my name is Frank. I'm from the company IRA from Germany and I would like to introduce our product range for you. So we are a manufacturer from Germany and we are manufacturing building automation systems, sensors, controllers, industrial controllers, switch cabinet controllers for heating and cooling. So first maybe I would like to introduce you our new building automation controller. It's a backlit controller. It's the first uh, one. Um, it is flush mounted and it fits to the 55 to 55 frame sizes that is typical in, in Europe. So that's we are offering several languages in our system and we are also offering modules and uh, controllers also for controlling fan coils, especially with EC fan coil control 0 to 10 volts. And we have a special set, we have uh, 10 applications uh, in our software included, so it makes it very easy for you to install or to, f to set up the controller in a BMS system. Otherwise we have some types of climate controllers, um, also for heating, cooling, for underfloor heating and cooling systems, so we have different types of flush mounted and wall mounted systems. Also, especially um, noiseless um, switch controllers, electronic ones, and B metallic mechanical ones. The next part is uh, our sensors. We're offering sensors for humidity and temperature. That's the main competence in all in the market. And we have a big um, product range uh, for industrial. Uh, technology, so we are um, also um, yeah, a leader in the market for switch cabinet controllers. We make manufacturing temperature controllers, humidity, or electronic controllers, and we are offering airflow monitors for liquids, for uh, air or humidity, capillary controllers, um, differential pressure controllers, and. The least our new product range is our new design. It's a plant engineering system. It's also based on capillar system. We are offering um, the advantage is you buy just one controller and you can just use it in three applications. You can use this controller for boiler thermostats or you can use it as a ventilation thermostat or a contact thermostat directly on the pipe. So that's a big advantage of this system. So you just buy one controller and you can use it for three applications. That's our new design. So Thanks. we started in the residential in the residential and industrial it parts, it depends. Also. Maybe hot water controlling, and that's the main application for this product. 
Is there an app or something on your phone? Yeah, we have also a, a controller system, but it's not. It's shown here on the exhibition. We have a wireless system that we are we're also uh, offering an app to control the controller by an app controller. And if, are there any figures you can quote in terms of uh, improving environmental factors or efficiency? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. Thank you. Okay, thanks. Hello, uh, my name is Kutlu Givanç. I am Business Development Manager for MTech Company. MTech is producing dry mortar uh, machineries for the uh, industry, production industry, and also dry mortar application machineries uh, for the, the construction area in, in Germany. And uh, MTEC also uh, the producing uh, some unique machineries for uh, diff different applications. And uh, we are in the industry more than 40 years. And also we have innovative machineries for the, uh, the future of the, of the construction techniques. Uh, one of these innovative machine is uh, the, our Connect series, which you can uh, connect your uh, mixing and plastering and pumping machines with the uh, uh, 3D application robots. And these 3D application robots can be uh, in warehouse area with a small uh, application areas or it can be in the, uh, the open area to make the, the big the villas or uh, several storage houses. In uh, Big Five, we are uh, the showing that MTech uh, is uh, making the dry mortar plants, and also we are showing that MTech is the is the, the machineries for the site equipments and innovative uh, innovative products. Uh, last for, for more than 40 years, we are in the in the in the construction uh, industry and. Uh, in the Middle East area, we are more than 10 years, and we have a lot of experience, and uh, also uh, for production of the dry mortar units, like a plants, and also the site equipments. Uh, for 3D, uh, we have uh, partners, which they are uh, applying their uh, the, the projects in the market, in, in UAE, in Abu Dhabi and Dubai, and Sharjah also, and also we have uh, partners in the other countries like in Oman and uh, uh, the other uh, the projects uh, which you can see. Here is the, the model you can see that uh, this is the special concrete for, uh, for 3D applications. Uh, and uh, the MTEC machineries is helping to, to mix the, this special concrete uh, with the storage uh, systems. It means you can have a bags uh, in the dry form of this material or you can have a big bags or you can have this material inside the silos. Due to the, your uh, application um, consumption, uh, we are transferring this uh, the storage material, the dry material, uh, to your uh, pumping machines. Uh, it can be here, like on the silo, and under the silo you can mix the material with the water, and you can uh, send it to your robots, or you can use the even the silo and the, or the bags with the small mixing machines like a dual mix connect. Uh, you can send the material to your robots. What is the difference of these machines? Both machines, all the Connect Series machines, and uh, you can see in our presentations also, you can connect these machines with your robotic system uh, computers. It means um, after the architectural design setup, and uh, you can start uh, first in the manually, but after that, uh, the, our machines can communicate with your application methods. And these methods also uh, is uh, like a start and stop or uh, also the, the giving the, the, the speed of the, of the application, but as well as uh, you have a, a lot of opportunity to connect your sensors, necessary sensors uh, with these machines and this 
the answer of uh, the, the data of the sensors can transfer to your computer system with our machineries. It means that you can have a sensors like a um, temperature of the mixing water, a pressure of the of the of the hose, and um, uh, whatever you need. Uh, any kind of sensors, like uh, thicknesses, uh, uh, adjustment, and everything, you can give this data and collect the data and report the data with your computer system. For that reason, uh, we give the Connect series name to our this kind of machineries which we are using in the 3D system. Do you know the maximum throughput? Of the machine. Maximum? Pump. Yeah, the maximum pumping, like how much concrete you can pump. Uh, yeah, it depends on the application. Uh, and we have a possibility to make from 5 liter per minute to uh, 8, 80 liter per minute output with the different machinery setups. But depends on uh, what kind of um, application you are doing. If you make it only the, the chair or vase, you need a little set uh, the output or if you make a big villa you can use the big silo system and you can use the big system with, and you can reach the 70 80 liters per minute 